Hi guys, and thank you for tuning in. Uh, this month is going to be a beautiful lucid dreaming sleepover, so um, I'm really looking forward to it. It's coming up, so look in the, the links below and you'll find the, the event link. So basically, it's £75 from uh, an evening, um, from 5pm till 12pm the next day. And it's a really good price for people who want to explore, to socialise, and to learn more, and to get some hands-on experience with uh, lucid dreaming. So basically, the only two things that you need to bring with you is some headphones and an eye mask. These are very two powerful tools that you need to bring. The rest is sorted out at the retreat itself. By every um, bed, there is a headphone port, which basically you plug your, your headphones in. And um, it's a typical standard 3.5mm uh, um, jack, which is looks like this. It it's what will fit in your smartphone. And what you do is you plug that into the wall at the retreat and you put the headphones on. Make sure they're stereo, you know, left and right. And then put your eye mask on. Now the eye mask, get any eye mask that you like. Uh, Google Mindfold or there's other ones out there that are very similar. Usually you want to find ones that have cutouts on the eyes. And what they do is just put you in a bit complete darkness. Now this is very important. These two tools are very important to bring. Uh, one, the eye mask puts out any uh, light distractions that may occur in the room. And the headphones listen to the, the vo uh, guided voice uh, brainwave, uh, brainwave entrainment uh, technology which I've created myself. So what happens, the whole event, you arrive at about 5 p.m. Uh, onwards. Um, Sociably, we start then on about half seven. We have an hour of talking and uh, some training tools and techniques. And then we put you straight in your bed with the headphones and the eye mask. We all sync together, listen to the same uh, track. And then we all come back down into the workshop room. We discuss how we felt, uh, how things got on. And then we do another session. And then after that, we have a little bit of a discussion on, on uh, conversations on consciousness, some talks on lucid dreaming, a little bit more information and socializing with some nibbles and mugwort tea to help boost lucid dreaming. So also to remember to bring pajamas. Uh, please don't bring your birthday suit. <laughs> if you know, whatever you use to, to sleep in or whatever it is, have something comfortable, bring your slippers, all the towels, blankets, um, sort of bedding is, is provided at the retreat. So all you need to bring is headphones and an eye mask. Don't worry if you don't have headphones or eye mask. There are a few here, but please bring some because they're only um, a limited amount for people. So uh, the next day what happens is that early hours of the morning, I may wake you up once or twice depending on how the sessions go, but usually about 5, 5 a.m. or 6 a.m. wake you up. Uh, we'll come downstairs into the, um, into the main uh, uh, workshop room, the, the gong bath, and lay down, enjoy the gongs, put, put your blindfold on and let yourself go and just see where it takes you. The, the gongs are very, very powerful for for all sorts of things, especially like lucid dreaming and, and getting deeply relaxed. So before then, I'll guide you through a bit of breath work and then just let yourself go. If you feel like you want to roll over and sleep, then just do so, but have the intention to basically have a dream. If you don't want to do the group sessions, don't worry, because in back in your bed, I can put on the a similar um, sort of lucid dreaming track for the early morning, so you don't have to have the gongs. If the gongs isn't for you, you're welcome to get up and go straight to your bed and have an experience there. Then we all rejoice into um, sort of the main workshop space after the session. We uh, have some feedback, see how people felt. We might even involve some mutual dreaming sort of exercises for people to sort of meet up in certain places at the retreat. So the retreat ends about uh, half 11 or 12 at uh, noon. And then after that, we all want to go together, perhaps to Glastonbury or another sacred site somewhere close by where we can just uh, hang out. So if that sounds like it's for you, uh, please get in touch. The event link is below and I'll see you there. Goodbye.